All right, everybody, welcome back to the Heath Barn. Happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Hope we've all had a lovely day. This episode was a lot of fun. Um, today is Thanksgiving. It's, uh, I'm putting this out a little bit later than I thought on Thanksgiving night, but I had to have me a little snooze after round two of The Grub. So, But uh, it was a very fun episode. We all had had our meal in the living room for a little while. Then I came out here to the barn with my son Stevie first. He kicked it off for the first uh, four or five minutes. Then he goes inside and he brings out my niece and her boyfriend, Paxton and DJ. They came out and we played a fun little game. Uh, the Detroit Lions halftime show, there was a very, very famous rapper apparently that I had no clue who he was. So I thought, hey, this could be kind of fun. So we play a game um, where I, uh, Pax- Paxton and DJ, go over the top 10 songs from this year and I try to see how many of the artists I can name and how horrible I am. And then we flip it and we go to like 1995, I believe, and I go through the top 10 songs or some of the top songs of that year to see if they can name the artists. So they came out next and they did a great job. And then they go inside and they bring out my brother-in-law, TR, and my sister-in-law, Shanna. And they are obsessed with the TV show Friends. So we had a little game where they have the buzzer on their phone. And I go through and ask them Friends trivia. And whoever hits the buzzer first and gets it right, blah, blah, blah. My wife Mandy's out here keeping score and kind of being the judge for some of them. So that was a lot of fun. And then the grand finale, my mother-in-law, Karen comes out for the last 10 minutes or so. And we kind of, okay, now this episode, there's a running joke. I don't want everybody out there be like, Oh, you're mean to your mother-in-law. Cause it was a joke, but we have a new recliner. Once you recline in a little bit, your ass goes back. Like you are back. You are flat. You are all the way reclined. And it swivels. It's a nice chair, and we like it, but it's more for my son, Stevie. So anyways, Karen got in today. I told her, I'm like, oh, get in there, yeah. But I'm like, I can barely get out of the thing. So it was just kind of a running joke about getting her out of that chair, blah, blah, blah. So whenever I'm making these jokes periodically throughout the episode, don't be like, oh, he's mean to her, blah, 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 because it's not true. Not true. Erroneous, as Vince Vaughn says in Wedding Crashers. It's just a joke because that recliner, once you get in that thing, it's kind of tough to get out. All right. So, but anywho, she comes in, and TR and Shannon and Mandy are all out here, too, whenever she's out here. So, we talk about the Mandy and Shannon growing up. I asked her some questions about that. Um, it was a lot of fun. And also, my two stepsons, uh, Drake and Spencer, even uh, have a quick little, uh, not appearance, because it's a pod, obviously, but they say a couple words at the end, too. So, it was a lot of fun. That's everybody that was here uh, today. And uh, so, again, it was a lot of fun. I'm just sitting here, and they're just coming in and out, in and out, in and out. And um, uh, it was fun. A lot of fun. Good episode. So this episode, I'm just going to title it Thanksgiving 2023. Hope everybody enjoys it. Hope everybody out there has had a great Thanksgiving. And welcome to the Heath Barn. Alright everybody, welcome back to the Heath Barn. It is a special Thanksgiving episode. We have uh, just finished our meal about an hour or so ago. Everybody's sitting around the couch. Couches, chairs, and so forth. I'm out here in the barn with my son Steven. Say hello. Hello. How's it going, buddy? Good. Alright. Um, so... He's going to kick us off, and then I'm going to send him in the house, and then we're going to bring out more people, and everybody that was here for Thanksgiving is just going to kind of come out here, and they're going to trickle in and out, and I'm going to talk to all of them, and there we go. So this should be a fun episode, right, buddy? Yep. Okay. 
Well, first things first, how about, Stevie, how about you tell everybody who all is inside? Who uh, all is here today eating with us? Uh, Paxton, DJ, Drake, Grandma Karen, Spencer, and Uncle T.R. and Aunt Shanna. There you go. So, we've got, I think you named them all. So, we've got my niece, Paxton, her boyfriend, DJ. My sister-in-law, Shanna, my brother-in-law, TR, my mother-in-law, Karen, and my two stepsons, Drake and Spencer, right? Yep. And you. Oh, uh, yeah. Right. Okay. Good job. So you named everybody. Now, let's talk about the meal. What all did you eat? What all did you have to eat? I had um, corn, um, a roll, turkey, and... Um, Did you have that cake? What kind of cake was it? I had um, a little bit of Stripe It Rich. Stripe It Rich cake. And what else do you plan on having later? Um, There's three of them in there. What? There's three of them in there. Three of what? What kind of pies? Oh, pumpkin pie. There's um, Stripe It Rich and the other one... Coconuts? Yeah, I think there might be coconut there too, but yeah, yeah. So I had turkey, mashed potatoes and gravy, then mashed potatoes and noodles, <clears throat> corn, green beans, roll. Uh, yeah, stuffing. Did you have any stuffing? I did not have <clears throat> stuff yet. I I will when I get back in probably. You will. Um, Gotta try it. Yeah, maybe later today I'll have some stuffing too. Right. So your tummy feels okay. Yeah, it's it's not really full and it's not hungry so. Well, that's good. Right in that, right in that good, uh, good zone. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Who were you yes. happy to? Who all were you happy to see today? Well, everybody. That's nice. Yes. We got to see Drakey, Spencer. Got you don't get to see Paxton very often. Yeah, I was happy to see Paxton. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you think this pod's gonna be fun? Yeah, I think it is gonna be pretty fun. Yeah. Um, well, you were, you were just kind of my intro guy. Yeah. So, um, <clears throat> let's see here. Here's what you can do. Maybe I'll, uh, stop this. This, this pod will be kind of, it won't be all being one thing. I'll probably start and stop it a few times while people are coming in and out. So Stevie, hmm? good job. By the way, what are we watching right now? A football game. What's the score? Um, Green Bay is winning 29, and the other team's got 14, so Green Bay's winning. Yes. Yes, they are. I need, I need fantasy stuff going here, so yeah. hopefully it'll get going. Um, all right, well, you did great. Yep. Now, here's what we'll do. You run in there, see who wants to come out next, but if Paxton and DJ will come out next, that's that's who I'd rather have come out first, okay? Okay. Think you can go get them? Yeah. Okay, now, tell everybody bye. Tell everybody bye and tell them Happy Thanksgiving. Bye. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs> nice work, buddy. Okay, you run in there and grab them, and I'll stop this, and then when the next people out here, I'll start her back up. So I just get Paxton and DJ to come? Yeah. Okay. All right. Thanks, buddy. Okay, we'll check back here in a minute. Okay. Stevie went inside, brought back. My niece, Paxton, say hello. Hello. And her boyfriend, DJ. DJ, say hello. Hello. There they, there it is. <laughs> All right, thanks for coming on. You guys can go in. No, I'm just trying. Oh. So, um, yes, we had Stevie on, and now you guys are out here. So, um, how'd you two lovebirds meet? <laughs> I'm just, I'm just College. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, so Paxton, tell them about yourself. So you are, tell them how old you are. Where you go, I mean, you don't have to say where you go to school. Like, what what? Year, year, and all that good stuff. Um, I'm a junior, nursing major, 20 years old. There you go. <laughs> DJ. <laughs> um, I'm a junior, youth ministry major, 21 years old. There you go. So one of them's legal for <laughs> growing up stuff. But All right. Well, we were inside, and um, there was a halftime show in the football game, and some little punk, like, in a vest and – Weird Jeans was rapping, and I had no idea who it was. And who was it, Paxton? It was Jack Harlow. Yeah. 
apparently he's famous. <laughs> so whatever. So I'm clueless with that kind of stuff. So I thought maybe they could go through and we could do a thing where they like <clears throat> look up the top, whatever, 10 songs of 2023 or something. And then they can name the song and I'll try to name the artist. And I am like today's football. So like there'll be a lot of people gambling. So I'll put the over under for me at one and a half. <laughs> I'll bet you I get, that's where I would set it. Like I might be able to get one. I doubt I'll be able to get two <laughs> out of 10. And then, <clears throat> but then I thought I would switch it around and I'll have them. You gotta, you have to give me your phone and look it up before you, cause my phone's doing this. But <laughs> then whenever, um, then maybe I'll go to like, uh, a year in the nineties or something and name the top 10 songs from that year and see if either one of you guys know any of the artists. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Now I'm really good at name that tune, but the, but the new stuff, I'm just like, I have no, I got, I got nothing. So, <laughs> all right. So go ahead and, uh, and uh, maybe give me a heads up on like a genre ish or something. I don't even know what they call the genres now. Okay. Well, this is like probably pop. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So you want the song name? Yeah, give me the title. See if I can okay, name it's it. It's called Cruel Summer. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, there was a song in the eighties by Banana Rama called Cruel Summer. <laughs> it's on the Karate Kid. You should look it up if you've never seen it. Um. Uh. Okay, hang on. It's somebody pretty famous, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Is it? It's not Taylor Swift, is it? It is Taylor. Yeah, Swift. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> nice. Well, there's your one. That's right. I'm already okay. Okay. Banana Rama's version's better, I'm sure, but it's fine. Okay. All right, then um, the next one would be rap. Okay. Yeah. Called Lovin' on Me. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, I knew I I I I know a lot of rap from back in the day, but okay, is it somebody that uh have they had? I mean, what have, have they had today? Are they old? Or are they young? No, they're pretty young. Okay. Um. Jeezy, Wheezy, Heezy, Sleazy. I have no idea who's... who's. Jack Harlow. Oh, jeez. I just saw him. If that was... If we had the volume up, I probably would have heard it maybe. Okay. One for two. Um, the next song is Paint the Town Red. Okay. And then what genre would that um, be? Probably pop. <clears throat> uh... Uh, the the one is there like a isn't there like a her or the one or they don't now they just like say adverbs to describe themselves or pronouns or whatever um i got i don't know um doja cat oh <laughs> darn it doja cat <laughs> yeah. good lord what is happening okay <sighs> um, i bet that's not her real name probably not okay all right <laughs> uh snooze Snooze. Okay, what genre is it? Um, probably like rap. Yeah, I have no clue. Okay, snooze. Um, and it's kind of, is it like a newer guy too? Jack Harlow. <laughs> no, it's SZA. SZA. <laughs> Jeez Louise. What was the one before that? Uh, what, paint the town red. By, uh, what, what was Doja the cat? cat? What, Doja Cat and SZA. <laughs> Jeez. Um, See, I could have made a. You guys, I'm keeping it PG for you guys. I had a dirty joke in my mind right there, but I'm keeping it to myself. Okay. All right. What's the next? Uh, The next one is, is it over now? Is it a poppy one? Yes. Taylor Swift. Yeah. See, I'm just going with her because it's like, it's, it's, it's her, it's her summer. Okay. Yeah. I already hit the over. Okay. All right. What's the next one? I remember everything. I remember. Country. Oh, okay. Uh, I, I don't have no idea what it is, but I'll just start naming somebody that's popular right now. So like a, a Morgan, a Waylon, Waylon, Morgan? Morgan Wallen. Morgan Wallen. Wallen? Uh, no. Is it a girl? No. Is it, uh, I don't know, uh, Chris Stapleton? No. Is it Johnny Cash? I'm just kidding. What is I have no idea. Who is it? Zach Bryan. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Zach Bryan? Mm-hmm. Okay, I've heard of him. Yeah. I've heard of him. I don't know, I don't know any of the songs, but I, yeah. Okay. Next one? Yeah. It's Fast Car. Okay, that's a country guy. Yeah. Cuz we me and Mandy heard it we were at we were eating. And it was really it's really really good. Now that's a remake of a song when I was about 12 by Tracy Chapman. Yeah. But you guys didn't know that. <laughs> no. Did you? Yep. Okay, good. Yeah, it's a remake. Um okay, is that the guy I said first the last guy? No. Damn. Um it's uh he's pop he's he's famous right now yeah. though. 
It's not the Morgan. Uh, it's uh, it's not Chris Stapleton. It's not uh, who's the other one in there that's pretty famous now. Give me like initials and see if I get it. L C. I didn't help at all. Okay, let's see. Uh, Luke Combs. Yeah. yeah, there we go. Nice. I had it the whole time. Okay. The next one is Greedy. Is that, that sounds like a rap song. I think so. Is it no, rap? that's a country song. Okay. Oh, my bad. Is it a girl or a boy? A girl. Lainey Wilson? No. Well, I, just first, I, just, I just know that's a singer. Uh... Okay, let me think of who's. Um, you know, let me Carrie Underwood. No. Okay, who? Tate McRae. No, I don't know her. <laughs> That's kind of a cool name, though. Yeah. Um. Next one is Last Night. It's a country song. <clears throat> Man. Okay, a boy or girl? That's a boy. Have I named him? Yes. Okay. Is it, now is it the Morgan? Yes. Wallen. It's Morgan Wallen. <laughs> nice. Yeah. Got like four. Yeah. And then, um, thinking about me, country. A lot of country. Okay, uh, okay, boy or girl? Boy. Uh, Chris Stapleton. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, have I said him yet? Yes. Is it the Morgan Wallen again? Yep. <laughs> nice. That's not bad. Go to, uh, do, okay. Well, I was trying to think of, uh, cause I don't know any young, um, actors either, but I don't know if like what movies I don't, that's, that'd be a little bit easier probably, but, um, I got like four or five. Okay. Yeah. Put that bad boy on, uh, 1995. Let's see if you guys can get any of them. Just get it on there. Don't, 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 don't look after you get on there. Like top ten songs. Yeah. I don't know if that's <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. Um, I wasn't kidding. We were talking inside. Like the music in the nineties was really <laughs> not good. Okay. Okay. This one. Uh, Gangsta's Paradise. Now, I'm going to th- let you in on something. It's a rap song. Okay. I don't know if you can tell by the title. <laughs> Gangsta's Paradise. I know the song. I don't know who sings it. Rhymes with... Julio. Did you get it? <laughs> nice. Did you know it the whole time? You were just letting her talk? <laughs> ah, you got to cut her off. Just tell her. Like, I know what it is. <laughs> nice work. Okay. One for one. You guys should know this one. Your mother may or may not <laughs> like this at karaoke. Uh, waterfalls. Oh, TLC. Nice work. Two for two. <laughs> um, there's more than... Uh, I'm trying to find ones I think you guys... Okay. Uh, hold my hand. Uh, it's a band that... Uh, Came out of the gates real strong and then fizzled, but they were like super popular at first. I don't even know what kind of, they're not alternative. They're just kind of a whatever. Hmm. Now the lead singer has been a very successful country singer years later. Blank and the blank. Hootie and the Blowfish. Nice work. There we go. (laughs) Okay. This song's called Fantasy. It's got a catchy little beat once you hear it, but the title doesn't... That wouldn't even rung about me, I don't think. <laughs> she had about a million songs, though, in this era. She's a little kooks. Is it Shania Twain? No, no, that's not a bad guess. So. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, I didn't narrow it down much when I said crazy, somebody... <laughs> Crazy singer. Okay. Um, initials are MC. Mariah Carey. Yeah, Mariah Carey. There you go. Very good. Yeah. See? I think. Uh, creep. This is like an alternative band. 
uh, they're kind of dark ish with some of their songs, but this one's one, this is one of them that went like super mainstream, got really popular, but do you think you know or no? I have, I have like the chorus in my head. <laughs> yeah. Starts, it starts with an R. Let me tell you. Yeah. It's Radiohead. <laughs> Do what? What you said? Say that. <laughs> Hang on, I was off there too long. Oh, okay. <clears throat> All right, let's see what we got here. I did something else wrong. <laughs> I'm ruining Paxton's phone. <laughs> I almost said Motorhead, but my bass not it. <laughs> yeah, they're a good band, though. Uh, okay. This is his 80s, but I think it must have been like redone it or like in the 90s. Total Eclipse of the Heart. Oh. Uh, Celine Dion? <laughs> no, that's good. All right, Paxson, you just, just make sure you guess every time, even if you don't know it. That's okay. good. It's good. It's good. It's good content. Okay. okay. No, that's Bonnie Tyler, but I don't even know why that oh, one's on there because no. that was like the 80s. Okay. I got one for you here. Water Runs Dry. It's like a, a boy group it's not like a boy band it's like before those boy bands came out this group had a whole bunch of songs they're all really good singers not a boy band though no it's before all those boy bands got together they were like in the mid 90s they they were super popular is it bon jovi no no <laughs> but keep guessing because it's good <laughs> Do what? What genre? Oh, yeah, it's like it's not. That's my fault. It's not like a rock band. It's like, uh, it's like uh, hip. That's no, not hip hop. It's R and B. There you go. That's what I was looking for. It's like R and B type music. You'll know when I hit when I say poison. No, <laughs> poison, poison, R and B, poison? Question mark. No. <laughs> But <laughs> come on, me say it. Yeah. Boys to men. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Do you uh, boombastic? This guy is a rapper, kind of uh, reggae-ish. Shaggy. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> nice work. Okay. That was funny. Um. Let's see. Strong enough. Uh. That was really popular that year. She was a, she had quite a few songs. She just went in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. I don't know why, because I don't really think she should be in there. But it's just like her and a guitar, basically. Is it a country song? Uh, no. Oh. Her initials are S C. <laughs> I'm getting looks like <laughs> Cheryl Crow. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Kiss from a Rose. Oh, that's Seal? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> nice, nice. Uh, Candy Rain. Mariah Carey? <laughs> no, but it's it's like a little R&B uh, boy group, too. They didn't have a whole lot. They had a few, but not too many. <laughs> It is Soul For Real. No, nope, never heard of them. <laughs> All right. Let me try to finish off here with uh, <laughs> what I think you can get. Glee. Let's see. Uh, take a bow. Okay, now this, I'll just give you hints about her. She had about a million songs in the 80s, 90s. Still, still has songs, but she's changed a bunch over the years so now she's probably 60 and her face looks pretty jacked up <laughs> you know Is but Beyonce? yeah no, <laughs> no. <laughs> beyonce's not 60 <laughs> might be beyonce's uh mom but okay she's uh she's like 60 and she had a, like her she started in the 80s 90s 2000s you guys she was like the most popular female singer probably like when i when we were, when we were like growing up one word starts with an m madonna there you go yeah <laughs> beyonce 
<laughs> Her face is jacked up and she's 60. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, there you go. See, I yeah, we both know pretty good. But yeah. um so you guys are just home for Thanksgiving. Yeah. And then I remember college. So you only have like what, a few more weeks and you get like a month off prior, right? Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, I remember all those days. So you're both like basically juniors? Yeah, we're juniors. Gotcha. Well, don't be like me. I was a junior about three times, so don't do not do that. But yeah. yeah. All right. Well, see, this was easy, right? Yeah. yeah not yeah. bad. Piece of cake. Piece of cake. Um, see if uh, your parents will come out, Paxton. Also, uh, and then we'll have to get the... Some sort of machinery in there to get your grandma out of a recliner. Yeah, but yeah. It's going to take a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thanks okay, a lot. Thank you. Good job. Okay. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and stop it again, and then I'll start it back up when Shannon and TR get out here. Okay. Paxton and DJ are inside. And now the effervescent Fishers. <laughs> I don't know. That just came to me just now. I haven't thought of that shit. Okay. Uh, Shannon and yeah. TR are back. <laughs> Shannon's, uh, she called it stage fright last time, but, which doesn't make sense because there's no stage here, but, you know, whatever. Stroh has a stage in Amazon. <laughs> yeah, get, see, get closer. <laughs> back, she's backing up from the mic already. Like, <laughs> yeah. We talked about, uh, okay, so Stevie's been out here. Mm-hmm. Paxton and DJ came out here. Uh He's DJ's not out here. What do you guys think of him? I mean, you got now's your time. You know, you guys want to talk a little <laughs> smack about. I'm just, I'm just. Kidding. We kind of like him. All right, good. <laughs> kind of like it's good. Uh, Drake for the first time. He did, he did. He did. He did. Uh, I think at the end I'll try to get Drake to say that's that, and then I'll put it out the. I'll put it on the end of it if I can get this. It. Yeah. Uh, so anywho, they're out here. We uh, had a nice meal. Uh, Karen's stuck in a chair. <laughs> Slightly. She's out. She's in the kitchen. She's going to. She made it out. She's ready. She made it out of there? She's in the kitchen with Drake. Uh, How did she get out? I didn't ask any questions. I just came right back out. I said, You're up next, Mom. Called the city. They brought a forklift. <laughs> I thought that uh, we were all going to make sure we were all there to see it, though. That's well, kind of disappointing. Kinda Let's get her back in there. At, and, okay. It's been around a couple times. Yeah. But uh, so she'll come out later. So that'll be. It'll be fun. It'll be interesting. All right. So. Thoughts on, okay, whenever we were on here last time, they said they wanted to do, because, tell them what your favorite uh, TV show is, or one of them. Oh, Friends. Yes. And they said they wanted to do some Friends trivia, but that's not what we're going to talk about first. Let's pour one out for old MP, old Matthew Perry. Mm-hmm. For sure. yes. Yeah. Shanna, you all right over there? <laughs> He's crying. <laughs> <A little teary-eyed. laughs> It's our first Thanksgiving. Sad. Our first Thanksgiving without Matt. Post. <laughs> <laughs> it hit hard. It did. It was. We were working and our kids were blowing up our phones. Mom, Mom, did you know? Did you know? Chandler. Both of the kids were. Yeah. Chandler's gone. Yeah. Well, and it was. Yeah, I, I've. I, yeah, I saw. It was surprising, just because. You know, young. Also, like we were just just talking about that show and everything. Like whenever we were, you guys were here, then it was just like a day or two later, wasn't it? Yeah. 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 Just a couple days. Yeah, but uh, so in honor of Chandler Bong, see, I remember, I, I there saw, we go. There we go. I've seen some of them, but uh, here's what we're going to do. Hey. Yes. Hang on. Real quick. Did you know? <laughs> I just have these random thoughts. Okay. I'm not leaning. Who, okay, go ahead. Did you know who his stepdad is? Yes. Yes. Okay, never mind. Date line. Keith Morrison. Keith Morrison? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I go think ahead. I knew Let's that. Let's do a little Keith Morrison real quick. No, it's, it's not me imitating him. It's like Well, you do Bill, Bill Hader yeah. imitating, which is a, a it's like, oh, oh. kind of got one of those things. <laughs> no, pesky yeah. dude. He's like, uh, Bill, Hader, Bill Hader was imitating him one time, and he's like, uh, he's like, so you shot him. He's, he's like, he, the, the, the guy's like, I shot him. He's like, oh, did you shoot him a dirty look? He's like, no, like, I, I shot him. Like, I got a gun, and I shot him. No, it's like, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. He was also like a really, really good uh, tennis player. I don't know if you guys knew that. Matthew Perry was Matthew like a 
borderline professional tennis player. Oh, yeah, tennis. but he was played pickleball the day he died, just right before. Which would, before. he would probably be great at pickleball if he sure. did tennis. He'd be yeah. good at that. Yeah, okay, so. Very cool. Got the trophy in the house. Do what? I think, I think that's something we could we could do this summer, all of us. A little pickleball. Uh, seems like. Uh, Captain set up the net and everything. Border, nice. Borderline exercise. <laughs> <laughs> you you won, I, uh, you won the championship at the. the I think it was. I think it's badminton. No. Oh, oh, those were oh. really fun. Really, really fun. Shuttlecocks. <laughs> Stevie knows. Hey the, Stevie knows. The Is that one of those rappers head. that I just named? Like on the. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> DJ Shuttlecock. <laughs> um. All right. So here's what we're gonna do. They both know their French trivia, or so they say. So, here's what we're going to do. I'm going to ask questions. TR's got a buzzer app over there. Uh, <laughs> okay. So, we're not starting yet. Just chill out. Okay, so you guys have Jenna's to speak. ready. Man. Okay, there's a buzzer in between them. They're across from the table. I'm going to ask a question. Uh... I was just going to go back and forth and have them answer them, but I think that they'll get them all. So I was like, mm-hmm. let's add a little drama to it. No pressure. No need to be nervous. Just having a good time. It's Thanksgiving 2023, <laughs> Shanna. <just> relax. <laughs> make, Thanksgiving, so, make Thanksgiving great again. <laughs> silence is not the best content on a podcast. Just throw that out there. But, okay, so. <clears throat> okay, so. I'll ask the question, whichever one of them hits up. You guys got to figure out your hand situation, too, because you can't have, like, one, you know, I wouldn't want, like, how about your hands got to be, like, off the table? I don't know. I got to keep it. I'm just trying to think, but I also don't want your phone getting smashed either, like somebody getting too excited. Okay, now, let's give the noise one time just so the people know. (laughs) Booyah. So, then I'll call on whoever gets it. (laughs) Mandy, you can be scorekeeper. Yay! Or, or, uh. That's fine. Yeah. I got it. I got a pen. Okay. All, <clears throat> All right. <laughs> They're focused. Okay. <clears throat> Are we ready? Mm-hmm. Okay, first question. Oh, I wish we had video on this one. <laughs> first know. question Which character has a twin? Shanna? Phoebe Buffet. Okay. <laughs> okay. There it is. Do I get extra? I get the twins. <laughs> no, if you get the what? Twins name. Oh, uh, no. But what is it? Ursula. Ursula. I remember that. Because she I was on like Mad About You once or something that's like that. That's correct. Yeah. I like actually somewhere. remember that. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's great. Oh, they're going. Ooh, it's going to be a fight on the way home. <clears throat> Who was Monica's first kiss? <laughs> Who, who was it, TR? Yeah. Her brother, Ross. Very good. Good. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, very good, very good, very good. Okay. Now, hang on here. Some of these, though, they've got the questions, but they don't give me the answers. They only give me two. We know the answers. You don't need the answers. Two multiple choices. <laughs> oh! <laughs> How is he going to know if you're right or not? <clears throat> it's true. Because they give me two choices the, from not, from three on. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll, do, we'll see what we got here. Question number three. How many sisters does Joey have? Shanna? Seven. I was going to say six. Well, that's what I'm saying. They're both on there. Do you push one? Uh, Oh, yeah. Tap on. You you got to switch one. You got to. 72% 72% of the people think it's 7, 28% think okay, it's 6. Okay, well, it's probably okay, right it's then. Yeah, so Shanna. Well, but, There's no but reason. we don't know <laughs> that. Well, I'll look it up. <laughs> Not on my phone. My, I'm recording okay, stuff. Okay, well, we're going to give Shanna the point on that one. Because it was 72% of the people. Hey, <laughs> horse this, was, uh, this wasn't well thought out, apparently. Okay. <laughs> she no. found the first thing she came <laughs> Here you go. Wikipedia's wrong. Yeah. We need one more phone. and we can, somebody can, Where's your phone? In the house. I think I need it. Well, maybe go. I'll yeah, go grab it. Okay. You can be the uh, We're gonna timer. You, oh. can, you can be the judge. I'm gonna pause this bad boy, and then we'll be back and with the phone, and we'll be able to be accurate with all this stuff. All right, we're back after googling. It was seven, so two to one, two one, Shanna. Wonderful. Two one, Shanna. Mm-hmm. I will give you a bonus one if you name them all. Okay. Marie, Teresa. 
Uh, Call yourself a fan. Okay. Number four. How many times has Ross been married? TR was first, too. Three. That's one of the options. <laughs> yes, right. it is three. Right. Yes, two to two. All tied up. Yellow Friday starts now, Shanna. I'm just let you know. Shop forty percent off fashion jewelry. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Got to pop up on your. Phone. Okay. Number five. What nickname did Monica's dad give her? Shanna. Nope. No, TR. Our little harmonica. Harmon- yes, it's yeah, harmonica. It. Mongular sounds wrong. <laughs> so wrong. That sounds <laughs> weird. <laughs> or what? Shanna. What? Okay, so what's the score? Give it. TR's got three. Good. You got one job. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just Okay, that's good. Okay, number six. What does Chandler... They, these people don't have very good grammar, but... What is Chandler's dad's job? He's yes? He's a gay burlesque singer in Vegas. I remember that. I'll accept that. He's a drag queen in Vegas. We'll take it. Very true. Gay burlesque. We got it. We, it's, it's tight. It's, it's a tight one. In. It's yeah. a tight one. And that's a famous <clears> guy that plays that. Oh, it's yeah. Kathleen Turner. It's Kathleen Turner. Yes. Yeah. That's, that's, that's a lady. Not a man. We're about 78% sure. Okay. <laughs> Number seven. What's the name of the dancer Joey lived with? Shanna? Give it a minute. You're going to break the phone. <laughs> Shanna? <laughs> Janine. Yeah, yes, it's Janine. <laughs> I was watching her break my phone. <laughs> I told, that's the only thing I was worried about. Crack. Oh, this one. Okay. Got to be quick on this one. This one's easy. Who got their own spinoff? Joey. Joey, yes. TR, we got... Oh, my gosh. Neck and neck. I'm... Anybody else nervous? I'm nervous. Okay. Anxious. Oh, you, okay. Be ready. What's Phoebe's sister's name? Ursula. Ursula. <laughs> that doesn't count. That does count. No, it doesn't. I already told an answer. Yeah, that's a wash because it was already one. All right. We're just making up rules. Okay. What is Rachel scared of? Yes. I went blank. Want me guys to give you the choices? Sure. Oh, I know what she's I know what she's afraid of. Okay, what? Swings. Swings swings, yes. It says either dogs or swings. I'm I assuming swings. Okay. <laughs> Number eleven. What is Joey's fake name? Ken Adams. Ken Adams is one of the choices. So I'm assuming that's correct. That is correct. The other one was Mike Hannigan. <laughs> so we're going with Ken Adams. Okay. Mike Hannigan is actually Phoebe's husband toward the end. Boyfriend, husband. Nice. Is that Paul Rudd? Paul Rudd. Nice, yeah. Paul Rudd, man, throwing them a bone. He was, like, famous even when that came out. Mm -hmm. He was pretty famous. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. True. Six to four. The host's throat got dry. Okay. What was the name of the millionaire Monica dated? I remember her dating one, though. If I remember right, it was John Favreau. It It is. is. <clears throat> Would you like the options? No. Okay. <laughs> because if I say that one for whoever, yeah, whatever. Yeah. I'm drawing a blank. Yeah. It's Pete, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, it's Pete. Okay. Yes. All right. So right, what's the score now? Six, Six four, four, Shanna. Oh, Shanna. Wow. She's pulling away. Plenty of time. Okay. What store does Phoebe hate? Pottery Barn. Ding, ding, ding. The other choice was Crate and Barrel. I love both. <laughs> They're both the crates. Okay. I think I remember this one. Who got stuck in a pair of leather pants? Oh, I know that. Ross. <laughs> Who's got their hands? <laughs> hey, 
Hey, <laughs> let it out on the pod. Hey, the yeah. nonverbal, <laughs> the nonverbal <laughs> aggression <laughs> doesn't translate on a pod. You gotta let that out, man. It's at the moment where he puts the <laughs> They're getting each other these the looks that are like this is bullshit. They have formed a peace. Yep, I remember that one. <laughs> in a girl in a in a date's bathroom. Mm-hmm. Yes, mm-hmm. and tries to get him on. With well, they like flour, they, or like he puts on like white. He puts powder. Yeah, yeah. And yeah and powder, 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 and flour. What am I talking about? Hey guys. Okay. <laughs> it's becoming a paste. <laughs> it's the only time I've tried it before. So I don't know if that's it. Like David Swimmer. Okay. What movie did Rachel say is her favorite? Oh, I remember that one. Now that I mean, I would. I know what her real favorite is, but I don't. Right, that's that's say. that's what it means. Oh. Her, her real favorite. Oh, what what is no? Um, what does she say is her favorite? Yeah, that's not okay. What does she say is her favorite? I don't know. I know her real favorite is Weekend at Bernie's. Right, but it's what movie did she say is her favorite? Because Joey goes Weekend at Bernie's, <laughs> looks at her like that. I remember yeah. that. Yeah. Yep. What do you say it? Probably something sure. real smart. Dangerous Liaisons. Dangerous yeah, liaison. she picks like a really good yeah. movie. What is it really? We can have parties. Okay. What did Phoebe legally change her name to? <laughs> okay, how are we going to call that one? Because she... Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> course, you got Banana first. hammock. Nope, that was Mike's name. Hey, oh, crap bag. No. No, ha- no, actually, it was banana hammock. She, Phoebe she named was, herself and banana he hammock crap bag. and he named himself crap bag. Yeah. So was it Regina Falange? Well, she, oh, I thought you meant when she actually legally changed her name. That's what it says. What did Phoebe legally change her name to? And what did Banana it, Hammock. What okay. Was the, what were the options? The options were Regina Falange, Falange or whatever, and Princess Consuela Banana Hammock. That, yeah, Princess, Princess Consuela, Consuela Banana Hammock. Okay. So who's that one, who's that one go to? Shan. That goes to Shan. We're just going to give it all to Shan. No, no that's no, all right. Get back. Hey, you got plenty of time. Up. Got plenty of time. Just get your hand a little closer. <laughs> look, 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 look where her hand is. Look where yours is. That's no, why she's winning. Okay. <laughs> Who she my hand hates Thanksgiving? That was. That would be Chandler. Yes. Okay. Okay. Shout out. Yeah. Pour some out. <laughs> I would, but this floor is not uh, <laughs> conducive. It's not conducive to pouring. Okay. Oh, yeah. Go ahead. Who? Oh boy. Oh, this combines some this other stuff we've done before. Who sang the French theme song? It's the name of the band. I knew that. I got this one. Oh my gosh! Um, I can't think of them, but I remember it was. Is it the Rembrandt? Yes, nice. it is. Got it. Don't wait. Call it a comeback. Free pillows, anyone? That, that's what the ad said that popped up. <laughs> <laughs> Don't call it a comeback. Free pillows. <laughs> All right. What was? Uh, what's Monica's biggest pet peeve? Clothes. Animals dressed as humans. Animals dressed yes. <laughs> ten to ten to six. Ooh. Ouch. Okay. What was the name of Rachel and Ross's grandmother? No. Rachel and Ross didn't have the same grandma. Okay. Well, that's clearly it. it should be Monica's. Yeah. Yes. It's my bad. It's all good. What was the name of Monica and Ross's grandmother? Would you like me to give one little hint? Yes. Starts with an A. I don't know. I don't think this is it. Adeline? That's not one of the... I don't... Yeah, I, don't I can't know. remember. The two choices were Alice and Althea. Althea. You're shooting with Althea? Yes. You're shooting? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <We're> Althea. <laughs> <clears throat> What is Chandler's dad's stage name? Oh my goodness. Big pun. Let's all just tell you that. Big pun in the. That's not the name. That's I'm just giving you a hint. It's a big pun. I think big pun would be nice. Big pun? He's a rapper. Big pun? I don't know. I don't remember. Hello, Hello Dad. I can't remember. Okay, I'm. Um, I want somebody to get this one, so I'm going to say, give you the first word. First word's Viva. 
Viva Las Vegas. That's the name of the show. Viva Las Vegas. That's amazing. Okay, so name of his gay burlesque show. Yes. They both kind of said it at the same time. So That's fine. Well, was the stage name X Benedict? Because that was the other option on here. Okay. No. All right. I'm going with Viva Las Vegas. Where did Monica get a pencil stuck when she was 14? Yes. No, I did. It yeah. was in her ear, wasn't it? I think so. Go ahead. Was it in her ear? Sixty-three percent of me thinks so. <laughs> yes, We're going with that. I think it was, yeah. <clears throat> All right. What is Joey's favorite food? Sandwiches. Yes, sandwiches. Good, good, Walk good. Away. How often does Joey get a TV guide in the mail? How often? Yeah, that's what it says. I'll say once a month. No, but this one, this question's kind of dumb. Because it's not going to The end. options are once a week or twice a week, so whatever. I'm going to start looking over the questions before I say them in case I think they're dumb. Okay, this one's a good one. Get ready. Get, your, get those hands ready. What, what's the name of Phoebe's most popular song? Tell Cat. I knew that one. That's the, one the only ones I've known. Can you sing it? Smelly Cat. Smelly Cat. Who's doing that? Are they yeah. feeding you? Yeah. And they try to get. They try to make it go. Uh, go big time in the background. And the girl's like, smelly, 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 smelly. You know all that. She's like, doesn't it's like not it. Your I love the show. I mean, come oh, on. Oh, yeah. Right. Classic. <clears throat> oh, boy. You better get ready again. This one's an easy one. Uh, what's the name of the coffee shop? Central Perk. <laughs> you need to throw in that your kitchen is Central Perk. Okay, my, my kitchen Central Perk. They got all the... There you go. All decked it's got out. the whole, whole decor. It does. So it's very cool. They live it, folks. <laughs> Just speak it. We live it. That's right. It's not all talk. Um... I don't know if you. I mean, I don't, I don't know this one, but I don't know a lot of these. Okay, where was the aroma room? Oh, that was in Phoebe's dollhouse. Yes. Burn it down. <laughs> now this one I have no idea, so I'll see if you guys know who has the last line of the series. Matthew Perry. Okay. Which one? Or where? Oh, that's what he says. They said they want to get coffee, yeah. and he goes, like, "Where?" where? Aww. It was improbbed. It wasn't. Um, it wasn't written. It wasn't in. That's gotcha. Very cool. What's the name of Joey's childhood imaginary friend? Starts with an M. See if that rings a bell. No, his imaginary friend. Starts with an M. It says childhood imaginary friend, so I don't know. Oh, it's Maurice. Maurice. Yeah. Maurice. Yeah. Maurice. That was the next question. What do you do for a living? I'll take the points. Here, I'll that one. <laughs> yeah, give, give him two. two. Hell, I'll give you. All right. Uh, what's the name of the comic book Ross made up when he was young? Or made or made when he was young? Science Boy. Yeah. Hello, Cool J over here. What? Come back. What's the Great. score? Don't call it. It's 8 to 16. Oh. Shanna's 16. I'm not. I'm not making a comeback. <laughs> yeah, but uh, who knows if she's doing that right or not. <laughs> I can write some. can write some. I can do half right. Who's the first person to appear in the opening credits? Ooh. Bet you regret skipping all these times. I... <laughs> wow. Yeah. Hey, you, need, you might need to look that one up because I'm not sure. Yeah, look that up because I'm going to... Do you want the two options? I'm going to say, is it Ross? No, it's, uh, when we get, you want the two choices? Yes. It's either Monica or Rachel. I thought it was Monica, actually. But, I have I'm no idea. I'm thinking when they flash with the, mm -hmm. the, uh, umbrellas and stuff. Is that Monica? I think Mon it, is it is Monica, Monica. because when, then when she gets married, they change her last name on there. And they change, and, and then they change everybody's, everybody's last name. name to Arquette when she gets yeah. married, yeah. Okay. Alphabetically, it says Jennifer Aniston, but for some reason, 
I think it's mine. Okay, ready to go to the next one? That's fine. This is, this is an easy one. Get, 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 get ready. This is this, as, as uh, an old high school friend, friend, or I wouldn't say friend, person would say, let's see who has the quicker reflections. <laughs> okay. You know it. We're not naming names on here. Hey, I-Y-K-Y-K. <laughs> That's a new hip thing kids you know, put on there. Know. If you know, you know. <laughs> Stupid ass. Okay, ready? Here we go. All right. I hate all that stuff so much. I can't. <laughs> Too long. Okay. Who's the manager of Central Perk? Gunther. Yeah. Yep, I can picture him too. <clears throat> but he was not the first. No, he wasn't. The owner was the guy from Alf, which right. was I don't I can't remember. Oh, the old yeah. guy from Alf? Yeah. Oh, he yeah. was like, yeah, I kinda remember him being like the first it. couple episodes, yeah. But I remember what Gunther looks like. Oh. Didn't Gunther oh, like Phoebe? Hey, Phoebe? Oh, hey. Does it, does it, does it, no, like Rachel. Oh, Rachel. Yeah. Okay. Does that sound like him? Gunther. Um Elf. Can you please, yeah. um, yeah. um, yeah. just please, um, please just go to bed, Alf. Oh, no. Yeah, no. that's it. Exactly like him. <laughs> Never tried that one. Okay. It's like Alf. I right, smell a new character. Hey, you guys remember the the dad from Alf? I can do his voice. Put him in there. Okay. All right. Uh, the rotation. Which friend was the only one to kiss all the other friends over the course of the show? I don't know if that means all five or... Just, just all the, just all the other sex. opposite sex. I have no idea, but. Ooh, um. I, I think it's Ross. Yeah. Yeah. He kissed his sister on there? Yeah. On that accident? Was, that was her first kiss. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But they didn't show it, or, uh, I guess. The, I mean, yeah. you, he kissed Phoebe on the pool table at the bar. What about Rachel, though? I mean, he married her, so yeah, they kissed a lot. No, I mean, did Rachel kiss everybody on the show? That, that was the other choice. Ross or Rachel? Oh, no, she didn't kiss Jim I would say Mike. Ross, because Ross and they did a what if. And Ross and Phoebe got together, Ross, so yes. Ross and Phoebe oh, yeah. kissed oh, on the pool table. Good Lord, easy on this one. Central Perky used to be a, a bar. bar. Right. Yeah. Who's got the reflections on this one? How many friends are there? Six. Indeed. Indeed, diddly. How many? You guys having fun with this? I think it's fun. Okay. Good time. Uh, where did... Rachel, Monica, and Ross go to high school. What's the name of their high school? Oh, another... Oh, God. Another central... Oh, another... Oh, you may have to look this one up. It's either... It's one of those two. It's 37. I'll know it as soon as you say it. <clears throat> I put the two names out there. Don't give anybody points. Uh, the... How about I just give you the letters they both... The, the, the two choices. One, so, the two choices. One's an L, one's a W. Another Lincoln Park survivor. Nope. Lincoln... Another Lincoln Park Survivor High School. <laughs> no, that's the, that's the that's the where they say it, the high school's name. What is it? Well, you said Where's Lincoln. Now? She said it already. Lincoln. It was Lincoln. Lincoln. Yeah. yeah. Okay. No, nope, no points, I guess. What is Rachel's favorite flower? Do what? Lily? Lily's is one of the options. Let me see. Oh, yeah. It's Lily's. <laughs> it's Lily's. What did Joey buy Chandler as a token of their friendship? And Chandler hates it. <laughs> a bracelet. bracelet. Yes. A pitiful. We're giving it to pitiful. TR. Yeah. Pitiful. Yeah, I remember that. What color is the ottoman in Monica's apartment? See those? I don't care if I watch something a thousand times. I don't. I'm not gonna cut that kind of stuff. Was it yellow? That's one of the options. Let's see what the the ottoman, right? The chair. That's mm -hmm. the chair. Seventy-one percent of people are saying green. The ottoman. Twenty-nine oh, percent. Well, I'm, it I'm is thinking green. the chair. I think the chair was. Uh, gotcha. It had like wild colors. If I knew my. Okay, this one's the answer. No. Does Phoebe have a middle name? Well, let's see what this says. She does not. She does not. You're both right. What color, another color one, is the couch in Central Perk? TR hit first. Orange. Show me orange. Fun fact for you. Well, yeah. Our son was out in L.A. Shout out to Preston. 
he actually he's not on set. He didn't come to Thanksgiving. No, he didn't. <laughs> he's not on the podcast. No, shout out Preston. I know. I'm saying this because Shanna said that he was like Matty wasn't going to be on the rest. So I'm just, yeah, I'm, just we messing, love you, I'm just messing. I'm just He's going to have to make a special appearance one day. But yeah, yeah. he was actually show me how to work all this stuff. Yeah. That's really cool. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. Got a picture Very of him on the on the couch. That's cool. Uh, yeah, that's really cool sets and stuff like that like there was a curb curb your enthusiasm where they did the old seinfeld mm-hmm. set and they're just like walking along and then they just you know they're like it's funny how when you watch these shows it's like it's it's not real it's just <laughs> yeah. like yeah. When, they, when they say cut they get up and they literally just walk and they go to a trailer it's about but 20 feet away from like whatever the diner, sh- you know, yeah. When yeah. They're, yeah yeah the yeah tv magic okay what does the title of every episode of friends start with the one with or where yeah the one you're right how does rachel remember her seat number for her flight to paris i don't know that one i don't i don't recall that one want me to give you two options Mm -hmm. sure one the it's either her apartment number or bra size I'm assuming it'd be her bra size. That'd make more. That'd make it funnier. Yeah, it's her. It, it's her bra size. I have to go back and watch that episode. Ooh, here's one. So it's an A. <laughs> Who is Aniston? I'm just kidding. Come on. Come on. It's a, it's a strong B. It's a B. Wow. Just kidding. Right, who's to say? All right, next one. Who is Tag? Rachel's assistant. <laughs> yeah. Who was the first person to find out Monica and Chandler were dating? Joey. Yes. Because that's a whole thing where he has to keep the secret. The buzzer was on a commercial. The buzzer had a pop-up. Had a pop-up. Had a pop-up. Had a pop-up. Where does Chandler move in to season nine? Where does Chandler move to in season nine? He moves into Monica's apartment. Tulsa, Oklahoma. There it is. Mom. There it is. I feel like we should have had... <laughs> They do switch apartments, though. There's a yes, whole thing they where do. they switch. Yeah, and yeah that's when they, yeah. they lose the bet. We should have done a thing where you, if you steal it, you get a double or something. Mm-hmm. Right. <laughs> what is a lobster? It's your forever love. Yeah, your person you're meant to be with forever, yes. That's the one where Rachel and Ross get Aww, together. Oh, God, you're my lobster. <laughs> Happy Thanksgiving, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Oh. All right, all right, all right. Let's do a couple more here. What word did Ross say he learned in karate? Unagi. That's, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> oh my Where God. was Ross and Emily's honeymoon supposed to be? Oh, uh... <laughs> we got a new sound. Whoops. We got a whip. Whoops. <laughs> Grease? That's one of the options. We'll see. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's what it was. It yeah. I think. Oh. I like this new buzzer. Who had the longest relationship, Monica and Chandler or Ross and Rachel? Well. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was Ross and Rachel. <laughs> yeah. No, 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 because uh, they were off and on in it too much. It's got Monica and Chandler because they, once they started dating, they just dated. Well, the yeah, because if you only calculate till the That's end of the true. show, that would yeah, be accurate. Yeah. I told. Uh, I can't wait till you hit that buzzer. I told TR I'm no. going to have a pod. I think where I just have those sound effects. I everything I say. <laughs> or I was going to have you on one and just like without you knowing, like every time you said something, just be like, <laughs> blast. Blast. you know, like. Yeah, yeah. That sounds about right. Yeah. Um, Final question. All right, here we go. It's a big one. Make it a hard one. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Spot on. That makes it. You, know, you guys, you office next time. Yes, oh, office. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Second there. favorite. Yep. You'll be. You'll. Be, I, I don't know all the seasons, just the ones we watched. <laughs> I'll just. There's three right here. I'll just do these three. Then we're done. Okay. What color are the shelves in Monica's apartment? Purple. Yes. It's not one of the ch- oh, choices. No, the shelves aren't purple. Teal. 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 Teal or blue. Teal. I'm giving Tier on that one because he's... Okay, this one's an easy one, so... Who does Gunther have a crush on? (laughs) Rachel. It's DJ Gobble. 
It's turkey trouble. I love it. It is turkey trouble. Okay. okay. This is this. Where do Monica and Chandler move to at the end of the show? Oh, gosh. Where, where, where was that? New, New Jersey? The two options both start with a W. I'll say that. Oh, um, outside of New York, uh, suburb, um, Westchester. No, I can't that's remember. A, that's a, that, that is a... It is Westchester, yes. Yeah. Nice work. That sounds like beep it a bobbity, beep it a bobbity. I like it. Happy yeah. Thanksgiving, everyone. What a great spot. <laughs> <laughs> so are we going to say Shannon? Shannon won. Yeah, for sure. Killed it. By, far. <laughs> By far. 25 to 15. Whoa. Gosh. That's all right. Yeah. As, as Hey, it's my as that know. same friend. Give it to her. As that same person from high school would say, you both made it to double gibbets. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's good. Jeez. <laughs> Is that turkey gibbets? <laughs> yeah, that's not. Double he gibbets. Just he just don't <laughs> talk so good. That's all it is. Double gibbets. That's yeah. very good. Yeah, gibbets. Do you eat gibbets on, on Thanksgiving? Thanksgiving? Right. Yeah. Eat double gibbets. All right. Well, okay. Nice work, you two. We got the grand finale coming up, folks. Woo! Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she, we need to leave that in here. That's good. She, we're going to talk recliners. We're going to talk. I don't know what we'll talk. I don't know. We'll see what happens. You guys stay out here. Be too, so we, yeah. But, uh, okay, I'm going to stop it now. And we come back. My mother-in-law. Dun, dun, dun. Karen. And that's not like a pun. You know, people like, don't be a Karen. Don't, she it's, literally it's really is, your name. She, her name. She is a Karen. I mean, she is a Karen, She's... and her name's Karen. <laughs> <laughs> just kidding. I'm just kidding. So, when we come back, she'll be out here. All right. Okay. Here we are with the, the grand finale. <laughs> it's my mother-in-law, Karen. <laughs> he's, got, PR. he's got the that buzzer that buzzer <laughs> app from the last from from the friends games coming in handy so watch what you say here karen or else uh, we got sound effects <laughs> <It's gonna blast. laughs> Thanks, TR. should we just get right into the recliner or do you want a little bit or should he do you want to talk about or do you want to go ahead okay, no. I, this is okay. So go ahead, tell them, tell them, tell them a little bit about yourself here, um, mother-in-law. Go ahead. Thoughts. Oh, thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> you got a lot. Come on. Um, just about today, you mean, or? What did you? What food did you bring? I brought turkey and mashed potatoes. A little dry. And no, I'm just <laughs> hey, I'm just kidding. Hang on, he's got sound effects. <laughs> he's got sound effects. Sorry. <laughs> I don't have a chance. With no, all no that's fine. Here, no, not a no prayer. What well, else? So you brought turkey, and then Shannon, what all, what all do you got? Eggs and rolls. Gotcha. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> that's all. <laughs> uh, that's so amazing. Yeah. Okay, so do you, well, let's talk about the chair a little bit. So it's comfortable, got right? A we got a yes, new recliner. John and Mandy got a new recliner. Well, I, okay, I got it off of, uh, Facebook. <laughs> I got a, kind of a deal. It's nice, but it swivels, and once you are in it, if you even want to recline, Slightly. it doesn't really give you a choice. It's like if you start to recline, you're you're going all the way back. Yeah, there's no so, down. You're down immediately. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, we're all, I would say, at least a little surprised <laughs> that you even made it out here, because <laughs> we got you. <laughs> DJ, help me. DJ, I, <laughs> I, Well, I came back, and I'm like, she's out of the chair. No. I also heard you were snoring in there while we were out here. Is that true? <laughs> I probably was. Okay. <laughs> it's, it's, it's comfortable. You just have no choices in it. You have to sleep. Let's sleep. All right. Uh, man, I was I haven't thought about what we were going to talk about since we got both the daughters out here. All right, let's see oh, here. No. Yeah, let's let's hit, let's 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 get into some stuff here. <laughs> who, whenever they would scrap when they were younger, who was better? Who was the better? Who was the better fighter? Uh, they were pretty even on that one because they would call me at work and. One would say the other was bleeding, and how come? Because she scratched me with her fingernails. That would have been Shanna. So I come home and ready to get on Shanna, and I look at Mandy, and she's got a handprint on her face that Shanna squeezed her so tight. Gotcha. She wouldn't quit talking. So they're pretty even. Okay, but if you were gonna, uh, now <clears throat> Shanna's also two years older. So if you say, let's say they're the same age, 
same whatever. One's in this corner. Mandy, in this corner, Shanna. Ding, ding, ding. Who, who's, who's winning? That's a tough one. Maybe Mandy. No. <laughs> <laughs> pretty, pretty feisty. <laughs> who what was the uh, best... Man, I should have written some down. This is just all coming out of my... Who, uh, weapon-wise, what was the the biggest or, like, weapon that one of them used that uh, you thought would injure the other one the most? Or the one that they used the most or something like the that? The remote control. They just start, they start each other? Shannon threw it through two rooms and hit her in the head with it. That's fair. <laughs> 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 TR's the sound guy. That's good. I love it. <clears throat> okay. Yeah, okay. Who was the bigger pain in the butt for you? Just, you know. That's easy. Gotta be me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who? Okay. That's what I figured. Um, <laughs> let me think here. That is. Let's see. Man, we sh- I should have came up with more stuff beforehand because I didn't know both of you guys were going to be out here. Um, who had, let me think here. Your first car was at LeBaron. Mm-hmm. Shannon, what was your first car? The Mercury Cougar. Was it blue? <laughs> yeah. I can't remember that. Tiara, what was your first car? Now I'm just going to. Ford Escort, baby. Oh, nice. nice. What was yours? Karen? A bug. Volkswagen bug. That's nice. pretty cool, actually. I had an 84. Wow, now it's cool. Oh, yeah. It was a Cadillac. 84 Coupe de Ville. Didn't appreciate it like I should have. No, you but did not. I know. How cool. Yeah. Um, let's see. What else here? Who was messier? Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> oh, the irony. And that is you true. got the jewel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. The irony is true since I'm a cleaning lady now. Yeah. It's yeah. so crazy. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. Who else here? Or what else? Uh, you said that Mandy gave you a harder time, but did Shanna give you a hard time at all ever, or was she just? Oh, yes, yeah, she, not real junior bad, rough, but yeah. yeah, junior high. She liked to lie just a little bit, <laughs> but hey, I think I, I had kind of a klepto phase in junior high. So I mean, things that you know, <laughs> shit, shit happens. It's fine. You move on. It's just yeah, a phase. Right. As long as things are just a phase, <laughs> they turned out okay. That's <laughs> yeah, right. that's right. Um, yeah. Oh my gosh. You guys, well, you guys. I love this. This is fun. I know, but I can't. You guys got anything for for your mother while we're on here? Who do you love more? <laughs> <laughs> she would say it depends on the day. That's right, John and Tia. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> Fair. Oh, no sound effect for that one. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't. <laughs> That's probably true. Well. That's easy. Uh, let's see here. TR, I was going to have her say, who was the favorite uh, boyfriend that they had besides us growing up? And see if- oh, gosh. That's <laughs> dangerous. <laughs> She's not going to have one for me, I can promise you. No, I didn't like her either. <laughs> None of mine she, she liked. Hers either. She didn't like she mine. Like mine but- mm-hmm. Tell him about that that's JD a, kid. That's a zero. Yeah, no doubt. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. We're not supposed to name names on here. But so. I knew yeah. she would. There's none that yeah. she's gonna say. Yeah. For me. Okay. You got anything for your mother? Oh, that's hard. <laughs> okay. What's your? Um, I'm. I'm gonna say. Worst story for each of us. Like, what was the like worst thing you ever caught us doing? Well, it doesn't have to be. It can't be. We should do that. Not, not like, not like in when you're older. Like maybe like when you were little yeah, or something. Yeah, you can go any age. Yeah. Henri's like when you're little, like Henri. She's not gonna have many because Shannon wasn't Henri. <clears> she was <throat> a lot Mandy was Henri when she was real little. Like she turned terrible twos at about one, and she got her teeth really young, so she bit all the time. She bit Shanna really bad in the back, and uh, she just and she'd go to preschool and. She'd be the last one out when I'd come to pick them up because she wasn't doing something she was supposed to. She wouldn't put her mittens on. She wouldn't finish her paper because her hands were tired. Holy so cow. I always had to wait till all the parents were gone. So she's one of those that there's a reason. She's kind of part of the reason like there's a teacher shortage. Yes. Oh, yes. I feel she's like one I, of those. I feel like I got it together in kindergarten, but, but before that it was, no. Yeah. Preschool. But there's not like one story that sticks out when she was little. Oh, probably. She has been sleeping, folks. She's a little slow. She's a little. She's been I'm snoring in the recliner. Chair. <laughs> a slight coma. Can't think of one. 
No, I, she can think about, about him preschool. in high school, but not in preschool. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to talk okay, about what about that. Shannon when she was little? Aww. Shannon was really good. And she <clears> really <throat> tried hard to please all the time. She uh, talked. She had a little speech thing going on. Oh, she here we go. She would help me clean, and she would say, can I clean this new mom? And that was two. I, suck up. One, one, she, yeah. one thing I remember her doing is we had a little uh, swing set, the little old metal kind, and had a little glider on it. Yeah. And she wanted to do a underdog with the glider and pulled it up and ran under it and got a big gash in her head. <laughs> She, uh, that's one memorable thing I remember. But Any broken was... bones out of either one of you? Mm-mm. No. Not when you were growing up? Never. No. Did... They both had the chicken pox the same day. Christmas On Christmas, Eve. I remember Christmas that. Christmas Eve. Mm-hmm. She did. We were going around the table <clears throat> talking about what we were thankful for today, and Karen said she was thankful that uh, Shannon got rid of her horrible speech impediment when she was... <laughs> 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 Me do. That's right. Thank heaven. What well, nice thing um, this year is this was the first Thanksgiving that I've been with both of them and their family since they got married years ago. Since Shannon got That's married. That's true. So That's that was true. really cool. We very were just missing one grandchild, Preston. <laughs> That's right. Uh, <laughs> I'm that not. I don't throw the phrase black sheep around lightly. But. <laughs> No, he's just, I just, we already talked about him being mad that he's not on it, so I'm just mess, messing with him. But. Love you, Preston, love you, Troy. <clears throat> yeah. Yes. I mean, we, you only got a two-parter out of everything. <laughs> That's really good. I gave you a two-parter. What else do you want from, right. What, yeah. All right, well, anything else before we, anything else we think of? I think we did pretty good. We had a little Stevie action, open it up. Mm-hmm. Paxton and DJ. Good 15, 20 minutes out of them. We had uh, an epic battle of friends trivia. <laughs> I lost. <laughs> they are lost. Horribly. Sorry. And we got Karen out of the chair and got her up here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank goodness. <laughs> I've ran that into the ground. I need to stop. But And then, okay, so we, because, yeah, what are we at? Yeah, this is about just perfect. So we can shut it down out here and then we're going to give it to my stepsons spencer and drake to sign us off right absolutely yes, cool. yes. wonderful to have them both here so there we go hey does it have, do you have the one like with the corny corny ass like full house where they start kissing it's like, Woo! <laughs> like that's like Lot don't even get that one for 99 cents to be asked, but yeah all right well okay we're gonna sign off to those two we don't have to do the closing because drakey's all over it so got happy thanksgiving happy thanksgiving. 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 Yes. thanksgiving all right happy thanksgiving everybody hi say happy thanksgiving happy thanksgiving okay now listen can you say that's that say that's that that's that oh boy <laughs>